All right. Uh, hello, everybody. I'm going <clears> to <throat> do a uh, quick repair on the uh, LCD screen of a Samsung notebook. It's a MP550P5CL. I've got my tools present. I've uh, got my replacement screen. Of course, you can see on the lower right hand side there is a uh, crack in the computer. So, the first thing you want to do is uh, you want to disconnect all power sources so I'm going to take the adapter out I'm going to close this and remove the battery as well and then the next thing that we have to do is remove this plastic part called the bezel the webcam of course, I've got a wedge that I'm going to use to try to separate the bezel. And this will probably be the most difficult part of the procedure. And what you do, you just kind of go around. There's a little crack here, so you can try to get your wedge in between the cracks. This takes only a few moments. Pretty soon we have them off. And you have to also be gentle. You won't have to replace the bezel. Like I said, be gentle, remain gentle. wasn't so bad. And so I can remove this and you have to wiggle. This is plastic and it is fragile. So you kind of have to be careful with it. And as you can see, there's a belt, there's an enclosure. And what you're going to have is you're going to have screws at the corners. And so what you want to do is you want to loosen those so you can get your screen out and put in your new one. And it's only these top two right here, so we're going to go ahead and start that. Also, I want to give a shout out to my son Jamal, who's helping me uh, record this video as well. So, as you can see, the screen is able to be removed. And it has a pin connector behind it that has the uh, adhesive tape on it. And uh, you want to be kind of careful with it. And what I usually do, I'll take one of my screwdrivers and lift the tape. I try to be very gentle with it because there's a circuit board present as well. And so as you can see, I've lifted the tape. And this is where everything conjoins. Tape stuck right there from home again. Okay. And you just gently pull it away. And you've taken your screen off. This is the defective screen. Also, to make sure that you have the right part, you want to match up this, the numbers. This, like I said, this is a Samsung computer. Also, also have to be very uh, particular. And I'm reading on here. It's, it says LTN156AT19-001. And this is the defective screen, of course. This is my new screen that's going in. So we want to make sure we remove the paper. I also like to send a shout out to laptopscreens.com, from which I order my parts from. Very reputable company. I recommend it to anybody. 
And so you see, I'm just checking out my area, making sure everything lines up, and it does. So I'm going to do everything in reverse order. I'll reconnect the pins. Make sure it fits snug, and there's the tape. Next thing is to raise the screen so we can remount our screws. So I'm going to screw it back in. Ah, oh, yes. I repair a lot of computer screens, tablets, um, desktops, smartphones as well, and uh, they're not all this easy. And I also have some fingerprints on the screen, which I hate. I'll just take my T-shirt and wipe it. Good. Okay. And last but certainly not least, I'm going to. Put our bezel back on. Like I said, it's, this is a fairly easy repair with this computer. Not all repairs are created equally. And so, with that being done, make sure everything's secure. Make sure everything's clicking. So what I'll do, I'll put my battery back in. And just in case the battery, we're going to put the adapter in as well and power on. Ta-da! Samsung. We have life. Like I said, I um, uh, did this repair to show uh, you know how easy it is. If you need any uh, help with smartphones, tablets, desktops or laptops, once again my name is Patrick Epkins. Feel free to contact me in reference to your uh, repair problems. I, I am CEO of You Broke I Fix, and you can contact me at 334-322-3763. That's all. Thanks. Have a great day.